I would go, I would take my son too. And uh, we would go and he would watch. <laughs> my son likes to watch. He would watch the other artists doing things. They had people doing silk screens. They had uh, artists painting. And I got interested in making the mask. So she asked me, she says, would you like to learn how to make masks? And I said, yes, I would. I never made a mask. So they had a very large mold. Sister Karen never did small things. Large. Everything was large. And had this big, large mold. And we made this big, big mask. And that, those masks were actually used in the Day of the Dead parade. So that's... The, the workshops would go through all the year. And those it was working towards the Day of the Dead. That was a big celebration. And that came from uh, Carlos Bueno and Antonio Ibanez, because they were both from Mexico. And they, uh, they knew how to do the altars, beautiful altars with lots of beautiful colors, flowers. And they knew how to uh, go to the cemetery, which we don't do here in this country. But, you know, they, they went. Pretty soon the authorities, the city of Los Angeles said, you can't do that. And, but they did. Then there was this group, uh, the Atro Capacinos, uh, what's his name? Uh, I forget his name. He's a film director now, he's a filmmaker. Valdez? Is this his last name? I think so, yes. Yeah. And, yes. Mm -hmm. And, and he would, he would uh, be part of the parade. But that's what we did, you know, on Saturdays, was working on these masks, making these big masks. And then it, it took time to make them. You take strips of paper, newspaper, with glue. And then once you were able to take it out of the mold, then what you did is that you would um, sand it down and then paint it. So I like that. <laughs> and I kept, you know, I go home and I, oh, that's right, Sister Karen told me, oh, there is a young man, he was from South America someplace, but he knew how to make cement molds. And he made a small mold for me so that I could make a regular mask. And I made him at home. That's what I did. And then I would take him to the studio for for exhibits on the day of the day.